If you like the Morris Brothers, check out the Funimation website, www.funimation.net, where you'll find lots of cool facts on Homer and Rupert, as well as t-shirts, cassettes, and other radically hip stuff. And while you're there, be sure to catch the other fun projects with Funimation, such as Dragon Ball, Cyborgs, and the hit television series Dragon Ball Z. Now on the Cartoon Network's Toonami Block, weekday afternoons. So don't miss out at www.funimation.net. Hurry, brother! Let's go! Light of the world that's in our hands is happening all across this land. There's pollution in our rivers, streams and air, and it's getting worse because no one cares. It's up to us to keep the world clean. It's time to put up oh, yeah, now. Ooh, or shut up. Woo! Oh yeah, and, and here's here our it. theme. Find the beat, brother. You got the beat? Everybody find the beat. Put your hands together. There you go, clap along. That's the best school in town. Sing it again, brother. Ready? This country is ours to love become one through unity. Like Michael says, it's okay if you're black or white. It's not your color that makes it right. But the winds of change flowing this way is what we've got to say. My brother thinks he's a ballet dancer. So what we want you to do, raise your hands high in the air, and let's clap up high as a team. Ready? One, two, three, go! Now everybody try this. Watch, it's called the head dance. Try it. It's a good stress reliever. Do it again. Come on, one more, everybody. Oh, I just burned the background. Hands in the air. Ready? Everybody, it's all about teamwork, working together to make this school the best it can be. Woo! Yeah! Whoa, brother, and that song wears me out. Everybody, take a deep breath. Hold it. I'll let it out real slow. Wow! Oh, shit! Come on, everybody, go, go, go! This is your best school I know. Uh, yes, it's good. Yes, it's fine. It's so good. It blows my mind. Hey, you interrupted me. Interrupted you? From what? Singing. <laughs> Singing what? A song. What else? It's a brand new song I just made up for the school. It's called, uh, what is it called? Everybody Go, Go, Go. You know, it could be your new school song. What I think we ought to do is get the principal, maybe the counselor, to sit on top of the building and sing that for you every day when you come into school. That'd be great. Get your parents to come up and sing back up. School board to play bass, you know, clavis, accordion. You know, I know you have music here because we talk to the music teacher. You know, you have music, so you listen to a lot of different kinds of music. I know I do. I like all kinds. I like uh, rock and roll. That's mm -hmm. good. You know who my favorite rock band is? Who? Not the Who. Hootie and the Tuna Fish. Now, there's a band for I you. like I them. Well, I don't know if they played here, but they're good. Yeah, we've got their eight track, don't we? We have all their hit. That's what I thought. Yeah, really. We have a medley of their hit. I like that. I like rock. I like country. Here's how you do country. Put your hands like this. 
This is how Leanne Rhymes got her start. What was happening is, is uh, the, her mother, Leanne's mother, said it was a miracle, brother. She was two days old, and she was in the baby bed. She started doing this, and then all of a sudden, for no reason, she did this. And it pumped air into her lungs, allowing her to make this noise. Try it, ready? See, I told you it worked. it does work. I told you it would. Wow. You know, I like that. Rock, country, I like, oh, Rap. Do we have any rappers here? <laughs> Brother, look at all these rappers. Woo-wee. I bet they come in really handy around Christmas. Oh, I bet they do. Rappers, you can put your hands down. I want to make a point here. This is kind of sad. Up until about a year ago, my brother and I, we didn't even know how to rap. We were rapless. And we were home one night watching TV, and they were selling these videos that teach you how to rap called How to Rap in Four Easy Lessons. And yeah, it's made by Reynolds. <laughs> yes, it was. And, and here's what it said to do. If you want to learn to rap, you have to start with the basics. And the first thing that all rappers learn is this. <coughs> Everybody try that. <coughs> now, that's the very foundation of rap. Yeah, this dates all the way back to ancient rappers. Yeah, well, from the country of Raponia. Oh, yeah. That's where it all started. Now, mm -hmm. now get this down. Get your fingers like this, because if you miss this part, oh, you're lost. It's kind of like on a test. You miss the instructions, you're lost. Right here, fingers up. Next thing, go over the top, kick your elbows high. There you go. Now, you have to be careful or you might get rapper's elbow. Well, it's like tennis elbow, but totally different. Mm -hmm. I think it's covered by most HMOs. Really? Next, bounce. Then make this face. Get some attitude. Go ahead, get a little attitude. Now make this noise, everybody. Ready? Woo, great job. Give yourselves a round of applause. Tremendous vocal talents and dancing here. Oh, my goodness. Hey, brother. But, you just reminded me of something. Uh, I must be a neuron sparker. We are going to have a contest to see who was listening the best here at your school. Me. So from now on, whenever we say give yourself a big round of applause, you go like this. So everybody give yourself a big round of applause. Go ahead and try it. It's literal day. Whoa, man, I'm getting dizzy. Where's the drama mean? And whenever we say give yourself a pat on the back, you go like this. That's easy. That's baby stuff. And Challenge. whenever we say give yourself a big hand, you go like this. Oh, wow. Woo. Boy, be careful on that one, though. That almost knocked my glasses off. Now turn to the person next to you, give them a high five, and say, we're the best. There you go. This is the best school in town, right? Yeah. Woo! Best school in the state? Yeah! How about the best school in the whole world? Yeah! School is cool. School, school. Brother, this side sing with me, that side with you. All right. All right, this side sing it with me really loud. School's cool. School's cool. School's cool. Good job. Pretty good. good job. Now my side as loud as you can. Ready? All right, here we go. This ready? side. Are you ready? School's cool. School's cool. That was this side really big, really loud, all right? Let's let them have it. Here it comes now. Ready? School's cool. School's cool. And they are Ooh, pretty good. loud. Woo, everybody keep clapping. I'm going to dance a little. Woo! The school the other day had so much fun, I don't know what to say. I wrote, I read, drew a little light. Woo! You know me now, I'm so smart. I like my teacher, she's really grand. She's going to help me to take a stand against drugs, violence, and all that stuff. Woo! That's how to prove that you're really tough. Yeah, I'm not worried what others might say. I'm going to stand for what's right each and every day. Because when I grow up, I want to be a star. And staying in school, I really go far. Yeah, I'm proud of my friends, proud of the school, proud to say that I follow the rules, yeah. You won't catch me dropping out. And all of this makes me want to shout that I know what it takes. I'm ready to win. And school's where my success begins. All right, my side, my side. Let's sing it big. Ready? School's cool. School's cool. Oh, my side. You guys can be louder than that. Ready? School's cool. School's cool. Oh, that was good. My side. Let them have it. Ready now? School's cool. 
school, school, school. My side, school. show them how it's done. Ready? School, 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 school. Oh, I love school and I fell down. Me too, brother. I like recess, lunch. Mm -hmm. You know what I like to eat? What? Chocolate covered tuna fish. Mm. Most of all, I like to learn because the more I learn, the more I learn. Pretty good. I've seen weird things through the microscope. Maybe learn to read or maybe climb a rope. Or hang my drawings out on the wall. Oh, that's fun. Or play a thousand games fine, of basketball. Fine. Well, I can reach for the moon, maybe study the stars. Or learn about dinosaurs, or learn about cars. Or do magic tricks in the science lab. Or study the shark, or the horseshoe crab. Yeah, all right on, brother, this school's a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. You can talk with your friends, play out in the sun. Learn to solve problems, get along with peers. Discover your strengths and prepare for careers. Yeah, you can make it happen, this school can be the best. This is all you have to do to pass the test. What? You gotta believe. You gotta believe. You can't achieve. You can't achieve. Don't fuss. Don't fuss. Discuss. Discuss. Don't fight. Don't fight. Unite. Unite. Do your part. Do your part. That's smart. That's smart. Use your brain. Use your brain. You will gain. You will gain. Go for A's. Go for A's. You'll amaze. You'll amaze. Just be friendly, everybody. Yeah. Put a smile on your face. And laugh. And, laugh. and have, have a, a good time. time. All right, this side. Ready? Let's clap and sing. Come on. School's cool. Now my Ooh, side, as loud school, as you school, can. Ready? School, 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 school. Back over here, loud as you can. Let them hear you now. School, 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 school. Woo, ready? Good. My over side, here, ready? ready school, 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 school. All the boys, all, all right. the boys. Boys, ready? School, 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 school. Hey, brother, what about the girls? The girls, ready? girls, sing it. Ready? School, school. Well, it's good being here today. We've been really busy lately. We've been traveling all over, visiting schools. Over 300 this past year, mm -hmm. schools we visited. We traveled in our 1960 Rambler sports wagon. It's Isn't a babe magnet. Rust green, white top, chrome luggage rack. Ah, it's a pretty car. You know, we have a lot of fun. We've been visiting a lot of places. And right. We do a lot of work for the government, even. Yes, we do. The FBI, CIA, DNA, XYZ, MSG. Yeah, all those groups. We have Boy. been busy lately traveling. Man. Boy, we get to go to a lot of interesting places. Oh, do we? Like Alaska, Antarctica, oh. Baghdad, Ooh. Bangladesh. All those states. Oh, we go. We're busy traveling. And, and no matter where we go, we meet a lot of interesting people. We do. And the way that you meet people is by saying hello and introducing yourself to one another. Good point, brother. So, brother, I think that's what we should do today. Say hello to everybody here, introduce ourselves, and make some new friends. That's how you make a friend. Let me go make a friend right now. All Let's right. see. I'm going to come right down here and make a friend. Okay. Right here. This girl. Right Why are we whispering? Hi. My name is Homer. What is your name? Katie. Katie. Hi, nice to meet you, Katie. Katie, this is my brother, Rupert. Rupert, this is Katie. Hi, Katie. Everybody say, what's up, Katie? What's up, Katie? There you go. We all have a new friend, Katie. Now, that's how you make a new friend, and do that. If you ever have new students move to your school, do that for them. It makes them feel really good. Puts a smile on her face. She's smiling right there. Yeah, that's how you make a new friend. Go up to them, look them in the eye, give them a smile, tell them your name, and then listen. And they'll tell you their name. Then do this. Show them around the building. Ask them to join you at lunch. Because you know how you'd feel if you went to a new school and you didn't know anybody. You kind of feel lonely. So, so help them feel like part of the group. And it's nice meeting you today, Katie. Brother, why don't we do this? Why don't we go ahead and introduce ourselves and tell everybody our names? All right. All right, here we go. Well, everybody, standing here next to me right here. is my brother. You see, we share genetic material. Our family tree goes straight up. <clears throat> Ooh. Oh, hey, brother, show him your best muscle man pose. <laughs> He's good. Now, I don't want to flex my muscles too hard, though. I might pop this shirt off. And you know what, everybody? I don't like drawing attention to myself. When I go somewhere, I like to just fit in. I understand. Hey, well, then, show him your best ninja pose. Oh, yeah. Hey, Power Ranger Homer. Twelve degree black suspender ninja. Some call him the Barney Fife of Ninja. Oh, quit it. Now everybody, for those who don't know, this is my brother Homer Morris. Everybody say, hello, Homer. <laughs> hello, everybody. Good to see you today. Woo! And since he's my brother, that makes me his brother. My name is Rupert Morris. But you guys can call me by my nickname. 
It's the one that you gave me last 4th of July, I think it was, brother. No, it was Independence Day. I'll That's never right. forget that, ever. Well, here it is. Never. It's root beer. Everybody say, what's up, root beer? What's up, what's up, everybody? Good to see you here. And everybody do this. Put a smile on your face, turn to the person next to you, and say, good to see you at school today. You know, no matter where we go, we meet nice people because right. our, our nation United States is made up of people from all over the world and although we're different on the outside we're all the same on the inside, inside. When we get along we work together we help make our nation even better than it is today mm -hmm. now it all starts with you right in here in your schools by doing this by being good friends with each other, showing yeah. respect, whether it's to another student, a teacher, because when you do things like that, you help make our nation better, and it helps make this group here work together as a team. Yay. Hey, brother, you know you're right. I am. And we believe that team, T-E-A-M, stands for Together Everyone Achieves More. Well, let's all say that. Ready? Together, together everyone, everyone Achieves More. more. And you know what? We've met some friends already. Mm -hmm. We met Katie. I like to have good friends. What about you? I love to have good friends. How many out there like to have good friends? I think we all do. Good. All right, you can put your hands down. I want to tell you a secret. Can we tell a secret? Yeah. Here's what we found. It's a secret. If you want to have a friend, you have to be, be a friend. Right. And treat other people the way you want them to treat yeah. You. If yeah. you want people to say nice things about you, then say nice things yeah. about them. If you want people to share with you, then share, share with, with them. them. Right. And you do those things, you'll have a lot of friends. Now, we want to lead this song. It's called To Have a Friend, You Have to Be a Friend. And to lead it is this guy. His name is Bubba. Everyone say hi, Bubba. Hi, Bubba. And you know what? He's an alligator, but he thinks he's a choir leader. Here's what we're... It's kind of an identity crisis thing. Yeah. What we're going to do is when he jumps in the air, that's when you sing. When he's down... Hi, he bit me. When he's down low, that's when we'll sing. So we'll go like this. We'll go... <laughs> to have a friend. Then you sing. You've got to be a friend. That's how it goes. So sing along. To have a friend. Oh, will you be my friend? My hair's coming closer. Yes, I'll be your friend. Yeah, oh boy, I like friends. Yeah, will you be my friend? Yes, I'll be your friend. Oh, you know, brothers and sisters should be friends. Will yeah. you be my friend? Brother, Ooh. I already told you twice. I know, I just like hearing it. Oh, okay. All right, everybody, let's everybody clap, clap along. along. Let's sing this song together. Ready? All right, it goes like this. Watch. To have a friend. Here's your part. You gotta be a friend. Oh, they're good now. To have a friend. Here we go again. You gotta be a friend. Oh, Woo. sounds like a choir. Woo! Keep it going. To have a friend. Sing as loud it now. as you can. Ready? You gotta be a friend. All right. To have a friend. Ready? You gotta be a friend. Woo! Yeah, cause we all know everybody needs a friend Someone you can tell your troubles to And someone who will pick you up Woo! Oh, when you're feeling blue Oh, I like that part. Will you sing it again? Sure. All right, here we go. Now let's sing it loud, friends. Let them hear you everywhere. To have a friend. Sing it, man. You gotta be a friend. Oh, yeah, let's do it again. Ready? To have a friend. Ready? You gotta be a friend. All right. Yeah, someone you can tell all your troubles to. Someone who will care and they'll be there too. They'll never, ever let you down. Here it is, brother. No matter what you do. Oh, man. All right, big finish. Everybody clap along. Let's sing it now. Put a smile on your face. Ready? To have a friend. Here you go. You gotta be a friend. Oh, that's good. Again, ready? To have a friend. Listen to this group. As loud ready? as you can. You gotta be a friend. Oh, man, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's be friends. Woo! All right, now give yourselves a big round of applause. Oh, a pat on the back and a big hand. Bang. Brother, did you see what I did? What? I talked like this into the microphone. It wasn't here. I went. 
<laughs> that was good. Well, I don't know why I did that. I don't either. Yeah. Well, I like to, you know, I like to have good friends. We've been trapped. <laughs> Ow. Brother, what'd you just do? Well, I pulled the microphone off the stand and it hit my glasses. And if I hadn't have used my cat-like reflexes and moved, it'd have probably popped me in the head like this. <laughs> oh. Ow. I did it anyway. Brother. Ouch. Are you okay? Quit it. I think so, but I wonder. Did it mess my hair up? Hmm. Look. I can't tell. What do you guys think? Yeah! Oh, I sure hope not, because I don't want to look stupid. I'd hate to look dumb right here, brother. Some of these people don't know me. You know how people see you. First impressions are important. You know, brother, you're right. I know. First impressions are lasting impressions. Yeah. And you never get a second chance to make a first good impression. No. But you know, brother, I don't think you look stupid or dumb. Oh, thanks. I certainly don't think you look dumber. Oh, thanks, brother. I like the way you look. Well, thank you. I like your hair. Well, it is a pretty good hair day. I like the tape on your glasses. Oh, uh, here's more. Ooh, how many pins do you have? I have 27. That's a lot. Well, it's a plethora. Oh, and I really like your new shoes. Let's show the audience. Whoop. Everybody, this is the new Morris Brother Cross Trainer. It's good for football, basketball, baseball, backgammon, checkers, chess, you name it. Not to mention cheerleading. Right. You know, a lot of athletes tape their ankle. We tape the shoe. It saves a lot of time that way. Yeah. And the new Morris Brothers come with an addition. They're labeled inside and outside, just in case you're confused. Yeah. Yeah, well, I feel a lot better now. Well, you know, brother... You shouldn't worry about the way you look anyways. Well, you should be proud. Well, you know, I am proud now that you've given me all those compliments. Thank you, brother. You're welcome. You know, when we give someone a compliment, we say something nice to them, it makes them feel good. You know, puts a smile on their face. Nobody at this school likes being around people who call other people names and be mean to them. And you know why I think some people do that, brother? Why is that, brother? I think it's because they just don't feel good about who they are. They don't, you know, or they're not showing respect for themselves or others. That's right. You know, and people who feel good about themselves are good to others. And I appreciate you being nice to me. You know, we had a friend. Remember Charlie? Oh, yeah. We had this friend of ours. Every time something went wrong, he blamed other people. Have you ever been around someone like that? Mm -hmm. No matter what goes wrong, you know, we could be having a play and he forgets his line and blames the director. That's right. Or if he didn't study uh, for a test and he made a bad grade on the yeah. test, he'd blame the teacher. That's right. The teacher's Rides fault. Rides his bike, falls down, sues the bike company. Mm -hmm. Always something going wrong with Charlie. You know, and, and you don't want to be like that. You want to be responsible for your actions. That makes you a better friend. You can be counted on. You can be trusted. You know, helps you be a better student, better athlete, better everything. We want to do this song, and this is kind of a rocker. It's called It's Up to You because it is up to you to be the best you can be and it's up to you to take responsibility for your choices and it's a rocker and we need some rock and roll guitar players we sure do. rock and rollers can we get our rock and roll guitar players to come up come on out rockers right here yay here they come Woo, they're looking good look he's wearing the chinchilla Oh my god. It attached itself to his forehead, brother. Yeah, oh, that's how they do that. But actually, they have a actually genetically grown uh, Velcro. Genetically grown Velcro pops out of the chinchilla. That's because now, there's too you need your sunglasses on because there's too much light up here. Yeah. It's uh we wore our SPF 3600. Future so bright we had to wear shades. All Ooh. right, right there. You got it going. Now let's meet the guitar players. You are Aiton. Aiton and Tyler. <laughs> and what's your Cousin name? Cousin it. Sharisa. And Sharisa. So let's rock and roll with It's Up To You. All right now. Swing it, man. Get it going. All right now. Brother, do you have your guitar? Oh, I need my guitar. Yeah, let me have a guitar. Keep playing, band. I want to sit in with the band. All right, here we go. I got it now. Ready? Woo. Well, old Charlie, he used to say, sing it, man. Can't do my homework. It's stupid anyway. Well, my teacher, she's the meanest. She couldn't be any tougher. She's out to get me. She just likes to see me suffer. She piles on the spelling. She really isn't fun. It's my teacher's fault that my homework's never done. Yeah, right. When Charlie was in trouble, he would always complain. 
life at home is driving me insane. My mother's always saying, do this, do that. Whoa. Tie your shoes and brush your teeth and don't forget your hat. Clean your room, brush your hair, she really isn't cool. It's my mother's fault that I'm always late for school. We can blame it on a parent, blame it on a friend. Blame it on your teacher, that's the problems be again. You can blame it on the principal, but no matter what you do, consequences come, come back to you know who? You. Well, as Charlie grew older, he kept blaming other people for his problems. And here is the rest of Charlie's story. Ready? All right. Everybody clap along. Kick it in, man. Well, Charlie needed money, so he finally got a job. But the boss expects too much, and besides, he's a slob. Buttons to push, gadgets to turn. It's far too impossible for any boy to learn. But the boss is always on my back. I can't do what's required. Yeah, we're well, Charlie, now it's your boss's fault that you are finally wow. fired. Sometimes we have problems we don't want to own. Wanna put it on someone, don't carry it alone. And instead of reaching out the blame, reach out your hand. You may just be surprised how much they understand That if you take a little heat, there won't be any doubt That it might really be your fault that things are working out Blame it on a parent, blame it on a friend Blame it on your teacher, that's where problems began You can blame it on the principal, but no matter what you do Consequences come back to you know who It's up to you Hands high in the air, sing it, ready? It's up to you Sing it now it's up to you. Come on, louder, yeah, ready? No doubt about it, it's up to you. This side, this side, ready? It's, it's up, up to you. you. This side over here, sing it now. It's up to you. Louder over here, come yeah, on Yeah, yeah, it's up to you. Over here, sing it again, ready? Oh, they're good. Woo! All right, now, big finish, kick it in, guitar. Up to blame it on a parent, blame it on a friend. Blame it on your teacher, that's where problems begin. You can blame it on El Nino, but no matter what you do, consequences come back to you know who. It's up to you. Guitar! It's up to you. Guitar! It's up to you. Charisse hit it! It's up to you. Woo, Rupert! It's up to you. Everybody! It's up to you. It's up to you. Wow! Big finish guitars. Wow! Big round of applause for the rockers. Sharice, Tyler, and Aiden. <laughs> Brother, I was just thinking about something. What? Remember when we were going to breakfast this morning? Uh huh. And we went into the to the restaurant, and when we walked in, people stared at us. Yeah. I wonder why. I don't know. But they were saying, hey, guys, why do you have so many pencils? What happened to your hair? You know, why do you have so many buttons? Why are your pants too short? They ask us all these questions. Well, brother, why don't we share with the audience why we look the way we do? What happened to us? That's a good idea. All right, you go ahead. Well, this is kind of a secret. Oh, boy. So how many here can keep a secret? <laughs> wow. Well, you can put your hands down now. All right. Well, I'm going to tell you a secret about my brother and me. You see, whenever we go shopping in the malls, yeah. or, or we go out to eat at restaurants, yeah. or we go snorkeling in the Trinity, yeah. whenever we do these cool things, the girls, they always come up to us, and they want to be our girlfriend. Oh. And when that happens, I get so embarrassed, everybody. Actually, I get beside myself. <whistles> Boy, that's not a good place to be. You're right. Well, here's the secret. You see, my brother and I, we weren't always the two cool, handsome dudes that are standing up here on your stage today. No, you might find it hard to believe, but a long time ago, the two of us, we used to be nerds. It was horrible. We did. Why we're on that 12-step nerd program. Yeah, go ahead, Hey, brother. brother, let's spell the word nerd. Shall we? Everybody spell nerd with us. Ready? N-E-R-D, nerd. And here's what we think it stands for. A never ending radical dude. <laughs> and everybody can be a never ending radical dude. Count me in. It just starts on the inside. Oh. But this is a story about how we came to look the way that we do today. Oh no. My brother and I, we were in our laboratory. Uh. It's kind of like your classroom. But it's as big as this cafeteria. 
and it's located in our underground treehouse. Well, we were working on a batch of our secret formula. My brother was standing next to me at the counter. No. And there was a pot full of boiling water on the stove. Now, as you all know, when water boils, steam starts to rise. Everybody make steam with me, ready? Dissipated. And here's what I did. Oh, no, be careful. I slowly reached into my pocket. Don't do it. To get the final ingredient for our secret formula. No. The water was boiling. Steam was rising. No. I held my hand way up high. No, 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 no. And just as I was about to add the very first drop, my glasses fogged up, and all of a sudden, we had a huge explosion. Wow! Oh, that scared me! Woo! Almost blew my shoes off! Almost knocked me out of my glasses! Man, are you okay? I'm okay, are you okay? I'm okay, are you okay? It's a good book. I'm okay. I'm okay. You're, you're okay. okay. Hey, listen, if you ever get scared, here's what you can do. I did. I got scared then. Did you? I sure did. Here, let's do this. If you ever get scared, just do this. Take a deep breath. Hold it. Now blow out like you're blowing up a balloon. It helps you relax. See? Plus, the doctor told me it would help to keep oxygen to my brain since I'm an airhead. Go ahead, brother. We're chilled out. Finish the story, Paul Harvey. Okay. Well, we weren't hurt by that explosion. Oh. Instead, we jumped up. <laughs> We ran over to the mirror, and this is what we saw. What? Our hair was messed up, yeah. and our glasses were broken to 17 pieces, and we were changed into superheroes on a mission to save the world. Superheroes like Batman. The Spider-Man. Superman. The Shaft. Ooh. But you know what really didn't change the way we looked, did it? Oh. Just changed the way we saw ourselves. After that, you know what, everybody? We didn't, you know, we didn't really think that it was that important what we look like on the outside. It's how you feel about yourself on the inside. inside. I know you want to look your best and everybody looks great, but what really people like you for is the kind of person you are on the inside. You mm -hmm. have to believe you can achieve. You have to have confidence. Everyone say confidence. 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 That means that you believe you can achieve. For mm -hmm. example, if you're in the classroom and the teacher wants you to read something, you say, I can do that. I can do hard things. That's confidence. Believing you can achieve is important because you know what? Look at everybody here today. Right here, everybody in this room, you're the most important people in the whole world. There's nobody else like you. That makes you very special to your friends, to your family, mm -hmm. to your school. That's why it's so important we take good care of ourselves by making healthy choices like getting right. good exercise. Woo! Ooh, that's a good one. Hey, I know one, brother. You know what you need to exercise? Shoes? Well, that, but I was thinking energy. Oh, that's true. Do you know where we get our energy from? Where? from the different foods that we eat. Oh, so eat a lot of food. Yeah, so it's important to eat lots of different foods from all the different food groups. Yeah, so there's two healthy choices, exercise, foods, getting good rest at night. That's a good one. Yeah, drinking lots of water. Mm -hmm. And staying away from things that could hurt you, like cigarettes, drugs, anything that can keep you from becoming what you want to be when you grow up. You know, brother, you're right. Now, I know a lot of you have thought about what you want to be when you grow up. I have. But you can't be whatever that is that you want to be if you do things like drugs. Because drugs, they mess with your brain. And if your brain is messed up, you can't make good decisions or no. healthy choices. Mm -mm. You just can't think right. And you definitely can't be the best that you can be. That's right. And we have a song all about making healthy choices. It's called Better Ways to Win. And what we want to do, we want, brother, this is kind of a rap song. Oh. What we need, you know what we need? What? Dancers. We need some go. rap dancers. Let's get some volunteers. We want some drug-free rappers. So rap along with Hip Hop Homer and Rap Daddy Rupert. It's better ways to win. Oh, man. Oh, that kind of scared me. The band's brother, the band jumped out of nowhere. It sure did. I think they're in the ceiling. Where are they? Hey, brother, I'm going to break it down. Watch this. Go ahead, brother. Go, Rupert. Go, Rupert. Go, Rupert. Go, go. Well, you might think that 
we are nerds, but we don't consider that a dirty word. Because we're proud of ourselves, ourselves being true to the good old red, white, and blue. Well, since some people smoke, smoke and they take dope, but we can find better ways to cope. But we read, pray, talk to our friends, we can find better ways to win. You know why? Why is that, well, brother? Well, people call us nerds. They call us nerds. Oh, yes, they do. Yes, they do. Woohoo, boo, we don't let that saying make us blue. Make us yeah, blue. because all the people. All the people. Right in this school. In this school. Ooh, love to watch your Homer. No root beer. Get, get down. down. Swing it, dude. We're a little different. We're a little different. Yeah, man, we will agree. We will agree. Ooh, boo, we have fun. We're always on the run. Yeah, we have fun. We're always on the run. Swing it, brother. Hit it, go. His name is Homer. My name is Rupert. We're both pretty flashy, but we're never dashing. Sometimes we're right and sometimes we're wrong. Here's what we say when we're singing yeah, our song. Yeah, well, our minds are sharp. Brain cells are clean. We don't take drugs. Know, know what, what I mean? mean? Audience, put your hands together. Clap along. It's round two of the Reuben Johnson Cardiovascular Spectacular. Here we go now. Well, I stayed in school. Played it cool. cool. Didn't want to grow up to, to be, be a fool. Because life sometimes can be so cruel. Yeah, now, there's only a few more things that I'd like to say before I leave you today. So listen, friend, I'm, I'm about, about to begin. begin. Here we go, man. Woo! Don't procrastinate. You should exercise. Try to see things through, through other people's eyes. eyes. Have a balance in your life. life. Believe in yourself. Remember, friend, better ways to win. You know why, bro? Why is that? People call us nerds. They call us nerds. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, that's true. Get it true. going now. Fool, we don't let that saying make us blue. Make us yeah, blue. Yeah, because all the people. All the people. Right up here dancing. Up here dancing. Ooh, love to watch your Homer. An old root beer. Get, get down. down. Swing it, dude. We're a little different. We're a little different. Yeah, man, we will agree. We will agree. Ooh, we, we have fun. fun. We're always on the run. Everybody do this. Yeah, we have fun. We're always on the run. Try this one right here. His name is Homer. My name is Rupert. We're both pretty flashy, but we're never dead. Yeah, sometimes we're right and sometimes we're wrong. Here's what we say when we're singing our yeah, song. Yeah, well, our minds are sharp. Brain cells are clean. We don't take drugs. Know what I mean? mean? Woo. Let's give a big round of applause for the great dancers. Woo. You may take your seats, dancers. Pat on the back and a big hand. Bang. Man, they were good. They sure were. Brother, did you notice all the many different styles of dancing? I sure did. I don't know if you teachers noticed it, but boy, they have some good dance teachers here. Sure they, do. Well, I saw, we, well, we started getting uh, this one going. What is that one? That's the anterior cruciate ligament dance. Elvis was big on that one. He could do both legs. The, and the kids were doing a great job. Yeah. I was doing this one. Oh, yeah, what is that one? The butter churn. The butter churn. That's a good dance. I like that oh, one. Oh, and I saw this one, too. What? What is that one? The mannequin. Oh, that's a, that's yeah. a tough Saves one. Saves energy. Well, you pace yourself. You mm -hmm. do that one all night long. Oh, yeah. A lot of disco going. A lot of different stuff. They had some great dances, but, you know, it didn't really matter how they danced. Here's the important thing, everybody, is they all had enough confidence to come up and try, and that's what it's all about right here at your school is try your Best. best. It's what your teachers want, your parents want. That's what you should want. Try your best because when you do, you do a better job and it makes you proud. And people who are proud of who they are, they take care of themselves. That's right. Yeah. And remember, that song was called Better Ways to Win because there are better ways to win in life than doing things that can harm you like drugs. Yeah. You know, someday, sometime, somebody you know could even be your very best friend. Yeah. They could come up to you. They could ask you to go ride bikes or, or go play basketball. That's cool. Or maybe even do drugs. And if that ever happens, my brother and I, we've come up with a few ways that you all can say no and still have confidence in what you're saying. That's right. So, brother, do you feel like doing a little bit of role playing today? Sure. Play like? Yeah. All right. Let's play like. All right. I'm going to play like everybody that I'm outside on the playground. And he's going to come up and ask me some questions. And here's a few different ways you might say no to a friend who's trying to get you to do something that you don't want to do. All right, here we go. Let's play like. Ready? Play like. Where is he? Hey, guys. Yeah, sure. I'll, I'll go ride bikes with you. What? You have some drugs? Well, sure, I'll do some. Hey, there's Homer. I'll see if he wants to go with us. I'll meet up with you guys in about 10 minutes. Hey, Homer. 
Hey, what's up, man? Hey, man, me and the guys, we're going to go ride bikes. Yeah? And guess what? What? Today, we have some drugs. You want to go? Well, no, man. I don't want to go anywhere where drugs are. Stop and think about what might happen. We could get hurt. We could get in trouble. Kicked off the team. It's against the law. Someone could even get killed. Uh, I'm too smart to start. I'm out hey, of here. Hey, man. Homer. Man, if you hang out with us and do what we're doing, we'll be your best friends for life. Well... I don't think so, because a good friend wouldn't ask me to do something that could get me hurt or in trouble. A good friend is a person that likes you for who you are. You don't have to do anything to impress them. But you know, if you want to impress me, just stand up for what you know is right and have the courage to tell them no and walk away. That's what I think I'll do. We'll see. But Homer, I mean, if you do the stuff that we're doing and take the drugs that we're taking, it'll make you feel the same way we feel. It'll make you feel good inside. Well, I already feel good inside, and I'm proud of who I am. And I think that's why some of our friends are taking drugs, skipping school, smoking cigarettes. They just don't feel good about who they are and think they have to do things like that just to get people to notice them. And, but I can think of more positive ways to be noticed than that. And I'm not saying you're bad, though, or they're bad, or I'm any better. I'm just saying that's not for me, because I want to grow up. I want to go to high school, play sports, go to college. It's not worth throwing away on drugs. Hey, I'm going on to basketball practice. We'd like you to come. Why don't you think about it? Hmm. I could hang out with them where they're doing drugs. Or I could go on to basketball practice with Homer. Hmm. Hey, Homer, wait up. I want to hang out with you. All right. Give him a round of applause. Good decision, brother. Thank you, brother. If they ask you to take drugs, smoke a cigarette, do something you don't want to do, just you could just stop and ask them to think about the consequences, what might happen. Tell them no, walk yeah. away. You could suggest something different. Uh -huh. Something like riding bikes, playing basketball, video games. Mm -hmm. Something that won't get you in trouble. Main thing, hang out with people who want to be drug-free like you do. And we have a superhero drug-free club. We want you to be in it. And here's what you do to be in it. Put your thumb out. And on the count of three, what we want you to do is say, I'm proud to be drug free. And everybody ready? Here we go. One, two, three. I'm, I'm proud, proud to be, be drug free. free. All right, now give yourselves a round of applause. A pat on the back and a big hand. Bang. You know, another good healthy choice to make is controlling your anger. I know That's a lot right. of times we get angry. You might get angry at school or at home if something isn't going your way. And you know what happens when we lose control? We blow up. Oh, we get in trouble. That's right. Bad things happen. That might have happened to you. How many have been angry before? Let's all show an angry face like this. <laughs> all right, now see. What was that face again, brother? <laughs> Now, see, everybody, did you notice how you turned that on? Well, turn it off now. Smile. See, you turn it on, you can turn it off. All right, and you know what we use to calm down if we get angry that'll keep us out of trouble and we want you to try? We use the chill, chill drill. drill. Tell them about it, brother. The chill drill is a three-step process. Three steps. First step, take a deep breath and hold it. Second step, blow it out like you're blowing up a balloon. Third step. Smile and open your hands. Oh, that helps relax. Now, we want to do this song. It's all about the chill drill. And, and you have a part on this song. What we want you to do, the song is actually called Chill. Mm -hmm. How it's a good name for it. Yeah. Here's what we want you to do. Now, during the song, everybody clap like this. It go like this. Well, the next time I get mad, I'll chill and freeze and stay frozen until Rupert counts to three. One, two, three. Three. Let's chill. All right, here we go. Clap like this. Ready? Chill, chill. Chill, chill. Goes chill, like this. Chill. Well, I got into a fight with Rupert because he called me a bad name. Sorry, Rupert. Well, he hit me so hard, my glasses flew off. My body was filled with pain. And so the next time I get mad, I'll chill. One, 
two, three. Well, I lost my turn at recess because I screamed out, that's not fair. Oh, brother. Then the teacher walked up and told me, Homer, go sit in the timeout chair. You got in trouble. And so the next time I get mad, I'll chill. One, two, three. Well, I used to fight, complain and shout, and really raise my voice. Ooh, but now I've learned to control myself. I am making a better choice. Thank you. So now I control my anger. It's lost its hold on me. I just take a deep breath and I blow out hard. And then I count out one, two, three. And so the next time I get mad, I'll shoot. One, two, three. Well, I used to fight, complain and shout, and really raise my voice. Ooh, but now I've learned to control myself I am making a better choice Thank you! So now I control my anger It's lost its hold on me I just take a deep breath And I blow out hot And then I count out one, two, three And so the next time I get mad I'll chew One, two, three Oh yeah, the next time I get mad I'll chew One, two, three and you know what, brother? What? I set a goal. Really? At what? Well, you can set a goal to become a better friend, better mm -hmm. student, better mm -hmm. school. Yeah. I set a goal to become a better drummer. And oh, I want, no. I want to play this song. My brother never lets me play. Brother, Take that's song. because I've heard you play. Well, I've been practicing on this song. I've been playing. This is a good song. It's Twinkle, Twinkle, Humpty Dumpty. My three pigs fell off the cliff. Thank you. That's an improvement. No, that's a medley. And that was the first song I ever learned to play, and I was not happy with that level of performance. Neither was so, I. So I decided to practice. You know, because what do you want to do if you want to get good at something? Yeah, you're practice. not born, you know, playing the drums or reading. You have to practice, work at it. And so here's what I said I would do. If you set a goal, you have to have a plan to achieve it and put your plan into action. Here's what I said I'd do. I prioritized. That means do the most important things first. I would come home from school, get home, I would do my work around the house, mm -hmm. do my homework, yeah. then I would play my drums. If you take any private lessons, that's a good way to do it. You know, your homework, work around the house, then practice your goal. And I right. practiced at least 30 minutes a day, four days a week at least. And I'd write it down when I did that. And then I would have free time where I would, you know, I would uh, climb trees, do yeah. fun stuff, mm -hmm. read the paper. I would, I would read a book, watch TV, call all my girlfriends. That was fun. I well, that, that didn't take long. Well, whatever. I want to play this song I worked on. Brother, will you play kazoo? Yeah. My brother's an all-state UIL kazoo champion. That's right. I won ensemble by myself. He even plays accordion with his toes. Go ahead, brother. Accordion to him, I do. Uh, get warmed up. I'm getting warmed up myself. <laughs> on the drums. Woo! Everybody put your hands together. There you go. Rupert Morris just back on a worldwide tour with Yanni and John Tesh. Never before seen in North America. Oh, it's the Antarctic tour. Go, brother! Woo! Everybody do what I do.
Now everybody try this. This is my favorite. Ready? That's the flight attendant. Oh, that scared me. Brother, you have been practicing. Boy, my pulse rate got up high, though. Really? Oh, it's really high. How high is it? 14. Well, at least you got a pulse. That's true. Yeah, you ever check for a pulse and you don't have one? Be sure and tell a friend. Immediately. Just get that out. In the, it's nothing to be ashamed of. It's truth. Get it out in the open. It's happening. Helps to you a lead a longer, healthier life. Well, that's pulses. Mm -hmm. That's true. Yeah. Well, you know, everybody here is good at something. Find out what it is. Work hard at it, and you can even get better. You know, just set your sights high. Make a plan. Put it into action. And you can achieve it. And you know, brother. Oh man, I just thought of something. A thought just came to my mind. I didn't think that was possible. Yeah. Just had it. Right here, and you remember what happened last week in the laboratory? Oh, yeah. Did you talk to the principal about this? I haven't yet, but I think we need to get this out in the open. All right. Go ahead and share it. All right. Now, this is another story. Oh, no. But it's a short story. We appreciate it. So I'll give you the cliff notes. Good. Last week, my brother and I, we were in our laboratory, and we have a superhero hotline. Yeah. It's one of those red telephones. Because every superhero has to have a hotline. Well, it's now mandatory. Yeah, state regulation. Oh, yeah, it's pitiful. I'll tell you. Well, last week, it rang 75 times in one day. woo -wee! And the people who kept calling us, they'd hang up on us. Yeah, get that. And the second we'd answer the phone, they'd hang up. Oh, I was upset. Oh. So my brother and I invented one of those phones that would catch people who called and hung up. Yep. It's better than caller ID. Oh, far more advanced. Oh, yeah. Blows it away. So the next time the phone rang, the signal shot into our computer. <laughs> Went into outer space, bounced off the space station, Wow! came back to our laboratory, and guess what we found out? What? The call was coming from right here. Oh, I forgot that, yeah. What you guys didn't know was that every time your principal would get up and leave the office, two young ladies would go in there, they'd call my brother and me, and then hang up. That's right. But we caught them, we wanted to bring them up, talk to them about it, get this out in the open. Oh. Actually, it's Miss Hanson and Miss Lafon. Come on up, where are they? I am shocked by this behavior. <laughs> What's your name? Good point. Uh, Jessica. Hansen. Oh, first name. Oh, basis. and you must be Miss Lafon. Oh, there you go. That's yeah. my brilliant powers of deduction. You ought to see him on a true false test. That's right. He if it's not good. one, it's usually the other. There you go. He is good. Tell Listen, you. ladies, why is it when you call us, you hang up instead of talk to us? Yeah, why is that? I was embarrassed. Shy. Oh. <laughs> Well, we get that way sometimes, you know, but taking a deep breath helps. Is it because we're so handsome? Yes. Well, I thought so. Uh, uh, by the way, are you any kin to the Hansons? Yes, they're my little brothers. Uh, don't they yeah. have a... Oh, yeah, that's good. Oh, wow. Hey. You know, people often mistake us for the handsome brothers. Yeah, we're kin distant relatives from Arkansas. Yeah. Now, listen, it's kind of an outreach program. Listen, Miss Lafon, we want to know, do you have guys like us here in this area? Yeah, do you? Not very many. No. Oh, that's a shame. That's just horrible. Well, listen, we're going to be around town for a while, so we kind of want to know if you'll be our girlfriends and go out with us. What do you think? Yeah, baby? what do you think? Sure. Oh. oh, boy, oh, boy. She said yes. She answered for both of you. Here, go ahead and hold my hand. Isn't this exciting? Oh, no, wait. Oh, wait, before we go out on our date, you know what I think would be fun? What? Have a dance together. So get on your feet and let's all shout. No, you make me want to shout. Kick my heels up, shout. Throw my hands up, shout. Throw my head back, shout. Come on down, don't forget to say you win. Shout. There you go, yeah, now shout. don't forget to say yeah, shout. yeah, 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 yeah. Say you will. Say right now, baby. Say you will. Oh, come on, come on. Say you will. Is it that you? Say you will. Say you will. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Say Isn't this exciting? Said you want me, said you need me, said you love me, she likes me. Wanna please me now? Come on now, come on now. Now everybody 
Johnny Twist Who I still remember Oh, when he used to be nine years old Yeah, yeah And I was a fool for you From the bottom of my soul Yeah, yeah, yeah Everybody out there, Twist, go ahead Put your house shoes on Put your twisting shoes on Yeah, yeah, yeah You want to leave me Where you want to let me go Here we go, high kicks, high kicks I want you to know All right now I want you to know right now Yeah, you've been good to me, baby Hi, better than a bet to myself Come on in here And if you ever needed me I don't want nobody else Join the group, ladies I want you to know Hi, how you doing? My girlfriend, Miss LaFont. Are you guys going to try out for the Rockettes? You know you make me want to shout. Everybody say shout. Shout. There you go. Ready? Shout. All right. Shout. All right. Shout. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shout. All right. Shout. Come on, louder now. Shout. All right. Shout. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shout. All right. Here we go. I want to tell you about my family. Thanks, brother. Cause I'm as proud of them as I can be Cause I love them and they love me My family Wiggle band Family Sing family Ooh. with us Family Who we got a lot of history In my family Well some of us are big Some of us are little And some are just well kind of and